Good afternoon, Wolfpack. I'm Damon Ramos. And I'm Tad Schilt. Today is Wednesday, November 30th, and we're here with your daily announcements. Black Student Union is creating care packages for the less fortunate this holiday season. Displayed on the screen are a variety of items requested. Donations are accepted in Miss Corbis' classroom in HB10, and if you have any questions, text their Instagram at BSUCOHS. Till December 15th, ASB is partnering with Men's Soccer and the Elk Grove Food Bank for a food drive to support our local community. They're accepting dry or canned foods, small cans, and ramen noodle packs. For any, domain, for any donations you make, you will be rewarded with IMCO tickets. Please bring all donations to the leadership room next to the cafeteria. Now, let's see what Ethan and Nisha have in store for us in entertainment. And I'm Ethan Nguyen, and tomorrow is going to be a very special day. It will indeed. So, to, the game. to start off, the in the Galaxy special has recently landed on Disney+. Plus. The holiday special is about Drax and Mantis going to Earth to give Peter Cole the best gift ever after they heard of Peter's bad experience at Christmas with Yondu. We also have Violent Night, an action comedy where soldiers break into a family compound and hold hostages. The only one that can save them is apparently Santa Claus. The trailers for the movie are Oh, I'll definitely watch that. It's such a random plot, too. I should go watch it this weekend. Sounds like a lovely idea. Another movie that I would recommend for you guys to watch with your family is Klaus, a 2D animated and 3D rendered film and a classic waiting to happen. From its unique animation and art style to its wonderful storytelling, this is a movie that you cannot get tired of. Now I'm going to have to watch it. The art style looks beautiful. Yeah, I thought you'd like it since you're an animation and art nerd. Well, that's all we have for you today, Wolfpack. I'm Nisha Sama. And I'm Ethan Nguyen. Happy, Happy Holidays! holidays. Thanks, Nisha and Ethan. Speaking of entertainment, sophomores and juniors are invited to come to movie night this Friday in the MP room between 5 and 8 p.m. They will be showing of Tim Burton classic, The Nightmare Before Christmas. Entry is free, but snacks and drinks will be available for purchase. Seniors, there is only one more college workshop left for fall. The workshop is in the College and Career Center next Wednesday and starts at 8.30 in the morning. Speaking of college applications, UC and Cal State applications are due today. Now, let's hippity hoppity over to sports. Start. Moving on, our boys and girls soccer teams played last night. Girls soccer won 3-2 over Bradshaw Christian. Way to go. Yeah, and our boys team tied with El Camino for their season opener. In other soccer news, the World Cup is well underway in Qatar. Last Wednesday, Japan defeated Germany 2-1. And according to NHK World News, the coach for the Japanese team showed them One Piece Film Red the night before their game against Germany. I gotta say, Jonah, they really went gear second on this one though it doesn't look too bright for their game against Spain. Maybe they're going to have to pull out a new technique. Maybe Gear 4th, Snake Man. Yesterday, we also, went, we also won against Iran 1-0. Looks like we can, can call it Iran now. Also, it looks like England, the country where people get minimal sun and call fries chips, had gotten soccered last Friday. Though it was a draw, we don't even call the sport by its right name, much less play the sport. <laughs> Football. Then again, Jonah, we have 56 Super Bowls over them. Yeah. In NFL news, Thanksgiving games happened last week, probably the highlight of Thanksgiving. Briefly, Bills won 28-25 over Lions, New York Giants lost 20-28 over Dallas Cowboys, Patriots also lost 26-33 over the Minnesota Vikings. But Darren, the Philadelphia Eagles are making a Christmas album. I am really excited to see how that goes. Me too. That's well, all for now. I'm Darren. And I'm Jonah. Back to your anchors.
Thanks for the update, boys. Now let's check out the Wolfpack Robotics team. Um, I'm Josie, and I'm the president of the robotics team. When and where do you guys meet? Uh, so we meet uh, every Tuesday and Wednesday from 6 to 8.30 p.m. here at the, uh, the workshop in, at our school. What do you do in the club? So we build a robot for uh, competitions that we then send to regionals. We, com we compete against different teams and then hopefully um, we'll win a regional and then we will take our robot to Texas to then compete in the world. What can you gain from joining the club? Um, so you can get a lot. So there's uh, everything including business, finances, um, engineering there's a lot of really big things like there's just a lot that you can learn i mean i came in um knowing just what a flathead screwdriver was and i came out uh or i'm coming out knowing how to manage a team uh manage events i learned how to design on a uh, cad system which is like graphic designing how do you feel about the diversity within the club we do have a pretty big uh, gender gap. We don't really have a lot of women. Uh, we have more men than women, so yeah. Is there anything else you want to add? Um, nothing is ever complete, so keep working. <laughs> Thanks for box love. Kaiser Permanente has announced the application window for their paid summer internship program for high school students. The internship provides an opportunity to gain hands-on experience with various non-medical careers, including finance, communications, hospital operations, and many more. You can apply from November 21st to December 23rd. Today, there will be an application workshop from 4.30 to 6 via Zoom. For the Zoom link and more info, please check your Synergy email. Well, that's all we have for you today, Wolfpack. I'm Damon Ramos. And I'm Tad Schell. And remember, the strength of the pack is the wolf. And the strength of the wolf is the pack. Happy, Happy National Methamphetamine, Methamphetamine Awareness Day, Wolf Pack. Pack.